and then she one shots me. And then I feel bad. Yeah, I'm gonna do the I'm do I think roll a roll a chalice into the entries. I don't like finishing off Grail, I don't think it's worth it. Yeah, I didn't take a single TP. Cancer would have been super good against their team. First time I have ever backed. Okay. I don't think anyone ghosted. They were just smart. It's the first I've ever seen a level one that was actually smart. I can't shove level 1 to get into tower, so there's no point for me to hard shove. takes move speed, so that's why it's a little bit weird hitting here. Okay, he flashed. like level 2 as well. I need to stall this. Oh god. They, that one hit tower? Man. Sometimes when you're playing mid lane, I don't think you should be worried about the jungler as much as you should just be... Should, honestly, the jungler should be worried about you. Like, you're the guy who's like strong. If the jungler wants to come mess with you, you should be confident enough to be like, I will just kill you. A lot of times I feel like they give them a lot, like almost too much leverage. I went in there because I knew he'd walk up to try to get that CS. And he did. Unfortunate. Ah. He's not gonna get this cannon. Okay. Deny him that CS was probably super good for me. 
I think I can kill him if I double Q Ignite Auto. Auto. But it might be a little bit close. Probably should went for the Q for that. I didn't think she would come up in auto that or Q that one though with a full charge. I think that was pretty strange by her. Oh, I didn't even think that would hit because normally she would walk left and dodge that one. Getting destroyed. If I can deny her this wave, it'd be super. I think I might. We want to blow flash for this. She's dead. He can't kill me. There's no way. You guys thought I was gonna die there? That guy's trolling me because he plays Andy. God, I almost was like, "What? What does that mean?" But he got me. I decided boots was gonna be more valuable here with a full callus than anything else. I could have gone health crystal blasting is typically what you go when you have a lead in lane, but I think I prefer the extra mobility in this situation. are feeding. Please just let me win my lane. And win the game. He misses Tibbers. He's tilted. I have a chance. Alright, who's here? Alright. Who isn't here? I'm just in the back here. I I, I I could pressure up mid, but just looking at that situation, immediately my my direct reaction is it doesn't matter if I stay because there's already people here. Any bending played that pretty bad. It's okay. 
I think Bard does excellent against um, that, by the way. Should I rotate bot? Oh god, something dumb is gonna happen. Yeah. Oh, I, I'm actually out of things so we missed cannon. Oh, my bad. He said. <coughs> oh, I destroyed them. Oh my god. Any bot somehow kills kills that. I've officially tilted the anti bot. Step one in winning this game already com 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 completed. Let's just say commenced. 11 minute Roa. <laughs> Holy shit. There's no way I tilted him that badly. He's going to roll as well. This is going to be dumb. Okay, so typically, you know, I pressure, you know, I try to joust this guy. Top lane's missing. So what's going to happen is Rengar's going to come in her bot. He's dead. I'm dead. Oh my god, the Lulu just mispositioned there so bad, or not mispositioned, she should have immediately been running bot, she spent so long sitting here with me, hmm, that's okay, maybe I should have told her to do that, because I didn't realize it till halfway, so there's no way, she, I, I don't think she would have realized it either. But if Lulu was there with the bot lane four man as they walked in, that would have been so good for us. And, and then all I need to do is rotate down to the Rengar while Echo's top lane. That was like the the play that we needed, but um, it didn't work out the way that we it could have. Luckily, I didn't have to use summoners there, so we're still okay. But also because Vayne went top lane and didn't get the CS, we lost bot lane turret and dragon, which shouldn't ha have happened. That was really bad rotations. Holy shit, stop this kick with my wall. I actually wouldn't have been able to save this, I forgot. The dragon is just too good. Um, so I guess we just would have done lots of anyways.
Chances of the Rengar comes mid right now. 100%? 200%? I mean, I'm like getting strong enough to fight this team. But the problem is, it's like, man, my team is so far behind. He can't walk in. Good, good E into my wall though. That was that was like nice. Cool. Uh, first this. Then I go my Andrews right. Oh man, actually. Mercs might have been better. I'm looking at this team, I'm like, oh, this is CC. I guess in this situation, I pray that God and he doesn't give me. God, I hate Rengar so much. I had flash, I could have just gotten away. Like I was in no danger there. Holy sh Oh my god, I didn't even check. That angle. Ulti. Oh, it wasn't, wasn't even up. My camera was pinned on the left. I thought I had this 2v1. 100%. And then the Annie stuck up on me. So immediately right here, I should have just pink worded this off the bat. I was considering it, but it didn't... You're dead. Maybe not. Oh my god, that kick! He has that, right? He's dead. Take the stacks. Nice. One more wave till I get um exact the Leandries. Oh, I didn't hit Candy with my E. Uh not Leandries, haunting, sorry. 20 seconds.
before I even flashed there. I didn't have egg. I thought I could flash and kind of take the bard, but bard E over. I should have immediately stopped what I was doing and or walled this instantly as soon as I saw it. I just needed vision on what was coming up. I didn't think it would be it would be uh, those two. I thought maybe it was just like the the uh, jungler. And then I saw the jungler down here, and I was like, no, it's. And then I saw the thresh hook, so I knew it was thresh. But then the one additional person, the Mordekaiser, made it hard. Such a big wave. I, I, I can't do anything. Like, my lanes lost so hard in my jungle. God, it's just the misplay right here, and the mid lane cost me so much. He's so strong. Me too. Holy sh! All right, me getting hit with the thresh hook is, is bad. He's gonna get one shot. Well... Okay, I'm on Landry's. That's a really good ulti on himself. Like, we have, we have the comp to be able to be Mordekaiser late game. I'm confident, but... Hmm. It's a little bit difficult, that's all. Okay, smart of him to be a crucible. He has no MR. Like, yeah, he's going Nashers. Whew. The reason why I consider Annie to be more of a threat is because I just think I think she's she can do a lot more than Mordekaiser. Mordekaiser needs to be in melee range to be able to do his optimal rotation. For me though, I ulti ulti. 
<laughs> Alright. the team does damage. It's actually crazy. I flash walled for Annie and we still weren't able to get a kill. That's... Morakaiser wasn't there. We essentially lost a 4v5. Mm. Let, me, let me look at their items now. Death Cat Void is probably best. I don't think Finishing Grill is going to help me very much right now. Finishing Chalice doesn't give me anything against these three. I don't need, like, I'm not gated by mana. None of these fights you're looking at, you're like, wow, man, I really wish Scar had more mana regen so that he could kill these guys. It's just, I run, uh, whatchamacallit. Sorry, taken. God, Decker can one shot me too. I don't know if I can be this far out. Oh, Baron's responding now. I need to be running. Kick him, kick him. Nice stuff. I have egg now, so it may not. It's not that difficult. I hit with the hook over here. What do I do in this situation? Look at this team comp. Mordekaiser should have went Abyssal, but... And he's going Death Cap now? That's so greedy. We could definitely exploit that. Mm. I think that Captain Void are the correct. He's dead. And like lemmings, my team kills themselves. so hard wait, wait, wait he went in too soon okay 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 it's not bad
why would people back off? The most, the highest priority thing Lulu should could have done there was get the E on Rengar, and then that way they could actually win the fight. Oh well. Very difficult game right now. This guy's got Seraphs, Roas, the Art Boots. I don't know how Annie's are supposed to build. I think th these builds like this are so weird. I imagine what she does is she just gets one rotation and kills someone, but uh, I, I don't know. That's why I think maybe I should play Annie more so I can figure out if that's actually like good or not. Uh, 600. Oh my god, I got stunned before I could cast R. Alright, whatever. Oh god, this game is just too hard, man. I messed up so badly twice and we lost the game. This was definitely a game where I had to carry because the rest of my lanes fell behind. Oh god, he's going Triforce. Yeah. Why would you go Triforce? That feels like... That feels like a snowballing item build. That's like the opposite of what we need. He's not kiting anything in this. He already has a Lulu. He doesn't need to to kite anything. All he needs to do is get like a get like a Thurster and then QSS, and then he has Lulu to speed him up. Like he can't ever go in because of the fear of the Annie or Mort ulti, and he's not gonna be able to get. I don't know. I I, I really dislike. Is it four? Wait, where's the insect? Alright. That's not what I expected, but alright. Do that damage on that thing. <laughs> alright, okay. Kill me. I thought I played at least the early game pretty well on, on Anivia. Mm, I just wasn't able to carry multiple players this game. If I was better, I probably could have. I my death cap. Void is too far away. This game's over right here. Hmm. 